How's Chroma mixed? One to two. One nope. to one and a half. One to one and a half. Very good. How about what's our what's the name of our demi color? Tones. Tones. And how how do we normally mix demi colors? Demi is usually you mix them without a developer, just directly, direct die. Okay, you're speaking of our semi permanent. Oh, it's all concepts. Okay. Seven volume. Seven volume. Yeah. And what mixing ratio of tube color to activator with the seven volume? One to one and a half. Nope. One to one. Equal part. One to two. So when we're in these situations and we're working with salons, this is what we're going to work. This is going to be your information center. Okay? So if you look, right here's chroma, tones, andiamo, dimensions, ultra hots, lighteners, and guess what? We even have Karen style. So any information you need, like mixing ratios, here's the mixing ratio for chroma, here's the mixing ratio for tones, mixing ratio for Andiamo is one to one, mixing ratio for, excuse me, Andiamo is one to one, and dimensions is one to one. If I need to know about lighteners, here's a section with lighteners. So if a salon is interested in getting into our lighteners, this is where you can go. You can sit down with the, with the salon and you can share this information. This is an awesome piece to have. This should be posted up in the back wall. That's normally Every where they salon that has it. Normal. And no matter what piece they buy, they've got everything there. Oh, I wonder what that's about. Exactly. So it's a great opportunity. So if they buy Andiamo, guess what? They're also going to be looking at chroma and tones. So, I've been getting some questions on this, okay? We have chroma, which is our permanent color, and every shade up here represents chroma. That's all chroma. It's all chroma, which is our permanent color. You see where it says tones? See where it says tones? That means those particular shades are also available in tones. Cool? Yeah. So you don't need another paper, you don't need another paper chart. So that means that I have all these selections in chroma, and then I also have them available in tones as well. Cool? How, often, how often do you update your colors, like add new ones? Um, it all depends. It all depends. Andiamo was our latest launch. Uh, that was in January. And we haven't really had a need to add anything new to Chroma because our range of 87 shades is inclusive of everything everybody has needed. But in terms of Chroma and Tones, of course, those are going to be your workers. This is your door opener. This is what you're going to go in with, and then you're going to circle back. Exactly. That's the express color. Then you're going to circle back. Here, I'll hold this so you can see as well. Okay, so, um, hey, in my salon, we do a lot of highlighting. What do you have for highlighting? We have the two lighteners. The lighteners? And, well, you know what, we also use a lot of color to highlight. What do you have as far as highlighting color? Or dimensions. Dimensions. <clears throat> because dimensions is off scalp, and it lifts over previously color treated hair. And natural hair. So it would be similar to your blazing. Okay, so just to kind of draw like what it is, that's what it is. Okay. Um, help me with what's the development time for chroma? Chroma. Don't have to guess. You lean on this. Look at okay. this. Find it. Look at this. And I'll just hold this up. You can work from this. What's my development time for chroma? So it's going to be 35 minutes for gray coverage, tone on tone. It'll be 45 for gray, white coverage, and one level of lift. So if you look, it's it's 30, basically 30 up to 45 minutes. Yes. Well, I always said too, if you're moving somebody from a number system to us, if you're going to do a 7 GB, well, that's a gold violet. You don't really have to remember a new number for it. Right. So the letter system is, I think, sometimes a little easier to achieve. I think.
We have two key things working for us with the tones. And and because I've used Vivian's and I've used Vibrance from Twitch. I find the workability of the color goes through the hair easier. Okay? okay. The actual application. Number two, on porous ends, when I rinse out the color, I, I find that I maintain more of that color in porous ends. And number two, I'm not shampooing the color afterwards. I'm using the color lock and I'm locking that color in. I think those three key advantages makes tones awesome. And tones makes an awesome deposit color. So if you're doing a demo and you do the new growth with chroma and then the mid length and ends with tones, it's amazing how many people go, they'll go like this, they'll go, wow, look at those ends. Look at even. I mean, you know, because it really, the, okay, so like, if you did a direct comparison, yeah, yeah, compa how do they compare to our 7G? Mm -hmm. That was the question, right? Correct. Okay. So I find our gold to be a little bit more on point with being gold. I find with the Schwarzkopf golds, particularly if you're going over porous hair, they tend to go a little darker. Okay? Okay. I find ours to be a little bit more true in the swatch. That's a good selling point. Well, I had, yeah. I had and I don't, and I don't like even with the Andiamo. I, I find that I don't have to push it as much. Andiamo. I don't have to push it quite as much. Right. Okay. They yeah. want to see what's on the chart. Sometimes they want to see what you get. You know what I mean? Like yeah. What you see is what you get. You don't want to have a guessing game. Exactly. You want it to be true. <laughs> Our so coppers are more natural copper. But then you can spice them up with the orange boost. So our copper's a little bit more of a natural copper. They don't tend to get as bright at the scalp. Okay. Okay. What What do most people say about your reds? Like, yeah, you know, I, I, some people say, Longevity. oh, this line has great selection of reds. I mean, like the selection and... They say two things. They say longevity mm -hmm. and the selection. Because we have a red mahogany, we have a red copper, we have a red gold, we have a gold red. So our selection of reds are more vast, so they have to mix less. But if you're talking to a more cured colorist and they like to play, then you can then they're a little bit more adapted going to the mixed tones and the gems to play with. Right. Okay? okay. So there is that other guy. <laughs> color prime color lock. Blue developers, Andiamo, you have three really strong opportunities to open the doors in the month. We're going to have a special for you guys next month, I think it is, for the, um, yes. I think it's $125. You get a Thanks, swatch guys. book, and you get scale, and you get a variety of the shades to try. So it's a great way to go out and place chrome. We're going to kind of focus it for Andiamo.